gamers, welcome back. Today I'm going to be showing off a game called The Hunter Primal. So what is this game basically? It's still in its alpha stages. It's one of those early access game. You know, I got kind of bored and I said, you know, let's go ahead and buy the game and see how it is. And to my surprise, this game is quite amazing. Uh, not in its state. But the idea has a lot of potential. It's a hunting game. The game doesn't take place on Earth like most people think, so there isn't any crustaceans, uh, period, kind of plants, etc. But it's it's kind of like a mix between sci-fi and a bit of Cabela. And the goal of the game is to actually hunt dinosaurs. Uh, there's only three dinosaurs in the game right now: the raptors, the triceratops, and the T-Rex. The weapons in the game are pretty limited. There's shotguns, there's a pistol, and then there's a uh, 308. But the whole story of the game seems like you're traveling to a planet to hunt dinosaurs, and apparently, you know, the ship goes out of control and you land, and all your stuff is all over the place. So you find these little containers on the map and you grab a weapon and you shoot dinosaurs. Um. <clears throat> It seems like they're still working on the hitbox, and like I said before, the game has a lot of potential, but I can't really fully review it yet until it's released. I can't wait to see more. The graphic is decent, not the best uh, for the character models, but everything else looks fine. Uh, the skybox is quite amazing in this game if you ever get a chance to see it. The whole moon and another planet floating uh, in the distance is really cool, and the land is pretty big itself. So here I am in the game. Or rather, here I am in the game, uh, excuse me, with two other players. Uh, you can actually play the game in PvP or PvE if the server allows it, but you want to hunt dinosaurs, crouching at, down in the bushes, you want to hide in the bushes, hide in different places. There's mushrooms around, you can eat dinosaur eggs, you can eat, but basically track dinosaurs with a little iPad device called the Settlemate. And then once you track them down, you can hunt them. Now keep in mind there isn't anything rewarding for the hunt yet. You get points, trophy, and a selfie shot. It's pretty funny, but all right, this triceratop is about to get hunted. Very careful about making our moves because it can get quite dangerous in this game. So it's not a game for everyone. If you don't have a lot of patience, I don't recommend this game for you. But if you do have patience and you do love hunting, or maybe a simulation type of game of survival, then you're probably going to like this game a lot. Oh no, she's running off. There's a group of them too. Probably because I stood up, or it saw someone. He's going to make the shot. And hunting as a team is ridiculously fun. Boom. Coming right for us. All right. That is one gorgeous girl. She's down. Anyways, enjoy the gameplay. That's all I gotta say about the game for now. I hope uh, I hope to see more from this game. I see a lot of potential, like I said, in it, and I am hopeful for it. So I hope they keep going on what they're doing and improve. Because right now, some of the negative cons about this game is probably how the server constantly crashes, or the game client actually crashes. Everything crashes pretty much uh, multiple times. So. You'll see cuts in this video because I have to always rejoin the game. I don't know these guys. I just kind of joined up with them to hunt dinosaurs. Alright, and depending on what kind of dinosaurs you hunt, um, as you can see, you'll use different bullets in the game. There's slug ammo, there's buckshot ammo. I shot that with the slug ammo. So you can see where 
then I keep going to the next location. We're trying to hunt a T-Rex. Um, gotta watch out for poisonous plants and raptors that are hanging around the trees. You don't know what's around the corner. I'm gonna try to find some footprints, dung track. Let's see if we can track us a T-Rex. I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward in the video a bit just to show you guys some of the th other things. All right, and those pink plants right there, that's poisonous. You don't want to run through that. Another thing I want to mention is there's no melee weapons in the game yet, so. Uh, there's a there's a base right there. At each of the bases, there's a PDA. And what the PDA does is actually tell you a little bit of a story about the game. So... We run up to the PDA, we grab it, look at it real quick. The square boxes are the supplies that you randomly find throughout the map. So there could be guns in there, bullets, etc. Your starting off weapon is arrows, bow and arrows. Can't really kill much dinosaurs with those. And, uh, or you could find armors. Armors is really important in this game, the clothes you wear, because they apparently help you with camouflage. They have a camouflage rating before a dinosaur can see you. Now you're probably wondering, how, how do I hide from dinosaurs? Well, like before, if you were looking, we either hide in bushes or you find stumps and logs. You want to hide behind line of sight, maybe behind a tree or inside these logs before danger passes. Maybe throw a rock and distract the dinosaur. Find rocks and throw it. Anyways, dinosaurs are dangerous. Oh yeah, there's also... It's also the awesome... Um, signaling. You don't actually speak to each other, you actually do these motions. Emotes. No, hand signals. Oh, that's dinosaurs inside. So we're hearing dinosaurs around this area, so you gotta be extra careful. Probably full of raptors. Now keep in mind, bullets is not plentiful. I do have some from finding it from a crate earlier. So we have our entire team scoping out the place. Ah, crate. Let's see. We have scope. Ammo. Just gonna go ahead and put on this hat. And kinda try to share the loot with your buddies. Now keep in mind, uh, right now, everything you do in the game carries over to other servers. I don't know what the plan is for once you start hunting dinosaurs later on, and I don't know if that will happen later on the end final of the game, but... Or the final product of the game, but uh, right now you can carry stuff over to other servers. So whatever you find carries over, and if you die, you lose it all. Unless you go and pick it up on that server. In case it doesn't crash. Anyways... Some more stuff. Those little blue vials are healing vials. It's um doesn't heal you right away, but it does regeneration type uh, of healing. Now here you can see that beautiful planet in the distance. Looks like the planet we came from. Like I said, the skybox in this game, gorgeous. I'm gonna find some footprints, some dung. Gives us a location of where it's at. Unless it starts screaming, we won't be able to know where the dinosaur's at. Now the dinosaur gives you off 
tracks easily and sometimes it roars in the distance and they also have different attack stance. So when you look at their stance you can tell if they're ready to attack you, you're wondering casually, whatnot, and that helps you focus where you want to shoot the dinosaurs. Now the hitbox isn't perfect so far but in a certain stance you're able to hit the dinosaur's lungs or liver. A long moment of silence because I'm I'm trying to figure is it wise to shoot dinosaurs in the liver? I meant lungs and heart. Maybe the head too. I don't even know where his liver is, even if I tried, honestly. There's no So we're wandering around the planet, it's starting to get dark. But this video crashes near the end, so what I'm gonna do is fast forward to another part. Now most of these videos I don't want to show you guys how I'm crawling around for like two hours. So I kind of fast forwarded it just to help out a bit but that's what I do in this game. I crawl around. You know, that's the only way to survive. Before I was running around and then I became a magnet for dinosaurs. They just completely annihilated me every time I was running and walking so I'm learning how to be a hunter. The hunted being the hunter. Let's see, he's, he's making himself a bait for dinosaurs when he runs around like that. You know there's a lot of um, raptors in the area. Just can't see him. Might as well just follow him. Yep, the footprint. That's another thing I don't like about the game is the way the server works. When people lose connection, there's always these little boxes popping up. If you want to drop them or not, it's so damn annoying. But hopefully we'll see a fix in that. Hear it. Watch out for the poison bushes. So as you can see on the bottom right, there isn't really much in terms of crafting or survivability yet. There's no um you know, you don't have to eat to survive or any of that stuff. It's not really survival. It's a hunting game, so don't be a... Uh... Oh, raptor! He's shooting with his bow with gunshots. Gunshots are going to attract other dinosaurs. I'm going to keep my eyes open. It's an easy dinosaur. Just in case. Can't mess with that buckshot. Go ahead and harvest the kill and uh, see all these information about the dinosaurs, where it was shot, what killed it, see that? And then who killed it? My shots didn't count apparently. Back to... We're hunting the most dangerous predator known to mankind, Tyrannosaurus Rex. I don't know where she is, but she's around here somewhere. Be extra careful, this is intense. You can hear her footsteps and her angry breath. Going towards this area of supplies. Why the fuck am I whispering? I don't even know, but just to be safe, I want her to hear us. Alright. She 
He's really close. Alcier, wooded areas are dangerous because you can't see the dangerous dinosaurs. Hopefully I can catch sight of her somewhere. I better hide in the bushes. Ben, Ben, bushes, Ben. There's no voice chat in this game yet, but let's pretend he can hear us. He knows what we're trying to tell him. I better type them. Ben, Jack, me, Pancakes. Now we got Ryujin who's trying to come back because he got killed by uh, the T Rex earlier. Trying to get to his stuff so that we can keep an eye on it. There's a supply somewhere around here. Very, very dangerous game we're playing here. I think there could be two of them. I'm not sure. I'm hiding right now. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. She just ate someone. You can hear the scream. Ryujin just went down. T-Rex. Just had some delicious meal. Of men. Very dangerous. I can't believe he's just hiding on this rock without being seen. While the guy running back towards us just get eaten. Oh, don't lose connection right now. Anyways, so as you can see, you can hear screams in the distance. The sounds of wildlife, and then all of a sudden, complete silence. Except for that dog in the background. There's no dogs during this period. Uh, it's gonna keep barking though. Because he knows. Oh shit, there she is. Sorry about the dog, by the way.
I can't believe that just happened during the most important time. Holy shit, she's right on top of us. Oh my god, I'm gonna... I'm gonna pretend I'm not moving. I don't think she... Oh shit. Holy fuck. It's like a Jurassic Park. I'm in a panic right now. She's looking right at me. She's definitely looking right at me. Alright, I'm not gonna move. On the count of three, we're gonna shoot her all together. I think that's the only plan I have, because I don't know what to do. She's right on top of Jack. She's on top of me. Oh, good lord. Alright, don't move, don't move, don't move. Nobody moves. Everybody stay still. Stay still. This could be my last shot, and it's over. God, she's still looking at me, dude. She's definitely still looking at me. Pumper! What? Yeah! She's dead, but, uh, her animation glitched out. That's okay, though. <laughs> That's pumper full of bullets, just in case. Yeah, this is, this is definitely a dead dino. Well. It happens. Alpha games. Well guys, let's make the best of it and uh, let's take ourselves a selfie. This is going to be the best selfie shot ever. <laughs> so, <laughs> so um, yeah, we did kill her. She glitched out. And like I said before, early access games. Um... All right, let's go ahead and line up in front of her. Anyways, guys, we did kill her. Uh, the animation just kind of glitched out. But thanks for watching the hunt. And I'll see you in the future for this game. So I'll definitely come back to it. Once they fix a lot of the uh, issues, such as T-Rex, Standing there frozen in time. Charles Xavier saved us right on time. Peace and game on.